it's all over the news. Another battle between Spider-Man and these demon mask gunmen threatening the lives of New Yorkers. I understand our next caller lives in the area. You're on with J. Jonah Jameson. Yeah, um, the thing is, it all happened in a shipyard that has been closed for years. There weren't any innocent people in the Oh, is that your expert opinion? Well, let me tell you what I've learned from sources I developed in my award-winning journalism company. That shipyard was a front for Wilson Fisk. He's been using it to smuggle guns, grenades, military-grade ordnance. Oh, that explains a lot. Ah, the group bomb strikes. But wait, here's a 50 megaton payload of fact. While Spider-Man tried to grab the okay, dude, himself, dude, come on now. Another. All right. <laughs> There's the Ooh. stage entrance. Oh, he's the Everybody son of right him. Out front. Uh, Sounds like a lot of people out there. You'll be fine, honey. Rio. Last time I gave a speech, I was in high school. Miss Steinberg gave me a C minus. Well, if only Miss Steinberg could see you now. Hey, you got this, Dad. I mean, come on, you saved Spider Man. I'm pretty sure that makes you an official superhero. <laughs> a superhero? <laughs> Or maybe I'm just a guy who doesn't give up. <laughs> okay. Okay. Come on, honey. That's fire. I can't wait to play the next one. Osborne. Welcome, everyone. And before I hand it off to Mayor Osborne, I'd just like to say a few words. Our city is so... so? I think this gang war may finally be over. Like, like over, over? I'm, I mean, there's some loose ends still to be tied up, but... Loose ends? Well, a truck pulled away from the scene from a company called Consolidated Shipping. Something's not right about it. I just don't know what. Hmm. Well, maybe after this we can grab some coffee. Figure oh. it out together. Oh! Yeah. Okay! Um, well, thanks, Jim. I was born. I said it better myself, but I'll try. In we all know that Officer Davis this is, this is a hero. But, uh, when this is coffee, the view. Maybe we could have dinner instead. I, oh, I man. I'll cook. Oh, man, you're pushing him, man. Or we could, you know, meet at a totally neutral location for a completely normal meal cooked by professionals. <laughs> for acts of extraordinary bravery above and beyond the call of duty oh it is my call of duty to present officer jefferson davis with a department oh, phone call. medal of honor phone call sir kind of in the middle of something here jim sounds urgent sir fine congratulations sir hmm is the deck gonna get killed here is that the spin-off? Uh, thank you, Mr. Mayor. I share this honor with my family. My wife, Rio, and my son, Miles. Miles. Without their support, I... I couldn't do what I do. Yes? I've worked many years for this moment. Who is this? Over the coming days, your company, your city, and everything you care about will be destroyed. People will beg you for help, but you won't be able to save them. <laughs> Listen, jackass, I get threats like this twice a week. Why don't you grow a pair and tell me what you want? Oh. To watch you suffer. Oh, the Harry? Oh, oh no, he's gonna die. What the fuck? Get out! Run! Oh, it's him! I liked him too. Oh, that's how they did it. That's how they did it. <laughs> Miles! Miles, are you okay? Oh, 
Don't tell me his mom's Miles. gonna die too. Miles! That would be a savage fucking Peter. Come on. Peter. introduction to this character. gonna be another explosion oh am i miles <gasps> oh my god what mom this is crazy over there Wait, that's supposed to be his mom? What? Are you okay? Nice going, kid. Are you okay? Yeah, 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 yeah. Are you, are you okay? I'm all right, What? Right. You sure you're okay? Yes, I'm gonna be all right. I'm gonna be all right. Be all, right. Be all, right. all right, Lisa. I, I, I have to go find Dad, okay? No, wait. Miles, no. Miles, no! What the fuck? That's, what? what? Dad's in there. That's not your mom. I'll find him. Okay. Stay here. Okay. Dad's alive. That's such a weird it. fuck up. <laughs> he was right there. What the hell? Holy shit, are they shooting civilians? Oh, that's the old DSO. Oh my god. Take him, I'll show you what's showing Gotta find a way around these guys. Can't cross yet. Shit, dude. Dad, 
Come on, dude, don't get killed here, so. to leave now Dad. 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 No! Wake up, Dad. Wake up. Wake up. Jesus Christ. like this dude. He's such a, a badass fucking cop. I'm sorry for the loss. I don't know if I'm tripping, but I thought the mom was blind. Do I uh, I'm Peter hey, Parker. What? I was at City Hall when. Look, I know you don't know me, but I just wanted to say. I know what you're going through. Uh, that's what you were gonna say, right? Or it all gets easier with time. Don't worry. It's, it's part of God's plan. I'm sorry. I was just try trying to help. I know. I'm sorry about that. I don't know what I'm going to do with him. Sorry, Jeff. I'm busy. What's up? Have you started looking for Martin Lee yet? No. I told you, I can't start a manhunt based on a hunch from Spider-Man. But I'm telling you, he's the guy! Get me some solid evidence and we'll talk. Solid evidence. Right. Hey, it's me. Hey, so what are you thinking? I'm thinking I screwed up. And that kid lost his father. I know you too well to say you should give yourself a break. What about the police? Do they have any leads on me? They're not even looking for him. Even Yuri doesn't believe me. Then it's up to us to find him. 
I've been doing some research. Go to this address. Martin Lee bought a controlling interest in this recycling center last year. You think he's hiding out there? Maybe. We know he's not at Feast. If he's not at the recycling center, maybe you'll find some evidence as to where he might be. Yeah. Good work, MJ. I'll let you know what I find. Oh, one more thing. I talked with a detective about questioning the arrested demons. They're all claiming Martin Lee has the power to, quote, corrupt people. Corrupt? What does that mean? They say it's sort of like mind control. It brings out the negative part of you. It makes you do things you wouldn't normally do. Huh, sounds a little far-fetched. It's coming from a guy who can run up walls. MJ's oh, right. big chunk is... The place is crawling with demons. Gotta take these guys out, then have a look around. Okay, that's all. Oh shit, I clutched that shit up. Hell yeah. He used me? Oh, high security lock. They use these on banks, not recycling centers. Maybe if I can find where it gets its power from. Yeah. Looks like I could override the circuit. I need my electric webs. That did something. It looks like the circuits need a little more juice. There. Looks like the circuit's still stable. Maybe there's another junction box close by. Gotcha. Almost there. One more box should do it.
Oh my god, okay. be where they're planning to attack. Wait, these are Osborne campaign offices. All the paths originate from the same address. Lots of high-tech equipment. Maybe later I can recycle this stuff into some weapons of my own. Explosives from Fisk's construction site. from Fisk's armory. Truck bombs? This is crazy. This wasn't a gang war. The demons were stealing from Fisk to go after Mayor Osborne. Hey, did you find Lee? No, but you were right. Lee's using this place as a front for the demons. Bomb making, gun running. Oh my god. And it looks like they're planning another attack. This time on Norman Osborne's campaign offices. We must have some kind of game with Norman Osborne. I found an address here. I think it's their staging area. If I hurry, I might be able to stop them. Be careful. Yuri, it's me. Make it quick. I'm busy getting yelled at by my boss. Martin Lee and the demons are planning another attack, this time on Norman Osborne's campaign offices. Are you sure? We've had a lot of false leads in the past week. Trust me on this one. I'm sending you the address of a recycling center. You'll find all the evidence there. Got it. I'll get those campaign offices evacuated. But if you're wrong about this, you're gonna help me find a new job. Here we go. What do we have this time? Consolidated shipping. Oh, another stealth oh, guys. Line. I should try to do this quietly, but also sure. with style. Using bad guys' own weapons against them? And that, my friends, is what karmic justice looks like. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I'm definitely gonna have fun with that one. Trip mine.
哪来的One second, everyone's on my fucking dick. God
知道。声音。那。Jesus. Not out here. Better check inside. <laughs> what is this? Good thing I stopped this when I did. You could blow up half of Manhattan with this stockpile. Huh. Invoice from an auto shop. Pale horse rides. That's one expensive tune-up. What else can I find around here? Bases all around the city. This is bigger than I thought. Looks like the demons have an army. This is what three already three things that I could do <laughs> off stream. Jesus, Murray, like over half done with this. Ah. As if one deadly glowing whip wasn't enough. I don't know what I was expecting, but it was definitely not this. Attack on Osborne's campaign offices. Nice. Finally. No, but I found something we should look into. A place called Pale Horse Rides. Sounds familiar. I'll check it out and get back to you. <laughs> Yeah. 
Finally. Jesus. Copy, Silverbird. We're descending to location. There's another one. Safety's off. What the fuck is well, that? This no, no, no. This one's mine. All right. I'm executing this son of a. Hey! That's not how we do things. Down! Down! Code SM1. Whoa, whoa! Before we do this, who the hell are you guys? Code SM1. Code SM1. Holding for orders. Copy code SM1. I have a visual. Hold for Silverburn. Are those cause, but they're like rogue now? What the fuck is that? Nice entrance. Solid eight out of ten. Nine out of ten. Release him. He works with us. Yuri, explanation, please. This is Silver Sablanova, head of Sable International. A private security force. Paid for by mm. Mayor Osborne. Oh, the mayor has a pet army now? Bro, Next time people. you get in my way, I will not be so gentle. Go. We'll talk later. What's a security? Private security that kills people? What? Huh? I should have told you earlier, but it all happened so fast. It's okay. We're still best buds. We're not best buds. Well, that took a dark turn. Anyway, Sable has the mayor's ear and unchecked authority. We've searched that address you gave me, found plenty of evidence of a bomb plot, but nothing that leads back to Martin Lee. I'm working on that. Hey, MJ. Hey, so I dredged up some records on Martin Lee's other business holdings. He's got places all over the city. Huh. The locations line up with a map I found at that shipping business. I'll check them out. Let me know what you find at each one, and I'll work on building a case. You got it. I'm headed to Lee's office at Feast to see if I can learn more about why he's doing this, and what he's got planned next. Okay, say hi to me for me. Wait, you don't think she's in danger, do you? No. Lee's only got one target on his mind, Norman Osborne. Um, so we're just gonna forget about Otto? Otto and his uh his shit closing down or forced to be closed down? Like what? Come on now. Peter. So if you're running this place while Mr. Lee's out of town, who's doing your old job? Uh, me. But I could always use more help. You know anyone? Actually I do. His name is Miles Morales. Why does that sound familiar? His father was being honored at City Hall. Oh. I talked to him at the funeral. He's a smart kid. He's just having a tough time. I knew a boy like that once. I remember it helped to uh, stay busy. It might help him too. Here's his mom's number. Thanks. I'll give her a call. Hey, you haven't heard from Mr. Lee, have you? No, why? Just curious. I've got a few minutes before work. I'm gonna look around, see if there's anything else I can do to help you out. Oh, you, you don't have to. I know. I want to. I should check out Lee's office. How adorable. Need help with those veggies? I learned a long time ago, you're more help staying out of the kitchen than in it. Ain't gotta ask me twice. Come on, no. Pete, glad to see you're okay. Hanging in there. 
<laughs> this office is locked. How do I get in there? Thanks. I appreciate it. Maybe there's a vent somewhere. Huh. Never seen that room before. Whoa, what the... High voltage lines. Needs this much power. I understand, but the account number is in Mr. Lee's office, which is inaccessible. I will call you back as soon as I can get that information. No, I don't know when that will be. <sighs> Lee's office is the other way. That room I saw from the crawl space. It should be right on the other side of the shrine. This is the ghost story Lee's father read to him. About a demon that could only be mastered through balance. Lee did so much for New York. I can't believe he was hiding such darkness inside him. Lee's journal. A key. Wonder where the lock is. Wolfskin Flisk has been arrested. I can barely believe it. The day a plan for Dream Dove is finally here. He sounds conflicted. Almost for, like he didn't want to head down this path. For some reason, I hesitate. Can I really go through with this? Things will happen so quickly. If I give the word, my men will claim Fisk's arms, his explosives, his secrets. We'll use that strength to teach Norman true pain. He'll know what it is to see the things he loves destroyed by his own hands. But achieving that that end will mean giving up so much. Everything I built here at Feast, all the good I've done could be wiped out if my plan succeeds. My chance is finally here, yet I still hesitate. Should I turn back? A part of me wants to, but the demon is hungry. I don't, and I don't think I'm strong enough to hold it back. Huh. The shrine in the photo is missing the picture. Looks like this note is for May. Dear May, very soon you hear stories about me, stories claiming I'm a terrorist and, and a, mur a murderer. Those stories will be true. He really did care about May. But the story we this wrote together, danger. the story of Feast is also true. I want you to know that I always believed in our mission. It wasn't a front or a show. It was honest expression of my shadow. When you hear someone, you truly do help everyone. Please don't let my feelings shake your belief. You're a strong man, strong enough to tell a new story at Feast. One unburdened by my faults. Thank you for all you've done, Martin. Damn. Vague. Hmm. Some kind of puzzle lock. Seems right.
This looks like that puzzle lock. Lee sounds conflicted. Almost like he didn't want to head down this path. Oh, I see. <laughs> I was just guessing in there. What the fuck? Okay. Whoa. What are you hiding, Lee? Lee's giving his powers to the others. How does Lee imbue these with his power? Bioelectric induction? Compressed phase shift? Lee sure is obsessed with masks. Is it a Jungian thing? Like, he needed to pretend to be someone else to let his darkest feelings out? Pretended to be a demon, until he became one. This is the folder MJ found at the auction house. I can feel my power growing, feeding off my anger. I can feel my power growing, feeding off my anger. Father would say I've lost the path of balance, but he could never understand. The only way to fight a monster is to become one. This might help us figure out what Lee's planning next. Creepy. It's a burn room, wired to destroy evidence. had found this. Or May. I want to think of what could have happened. This is all about Norman Osborn. His whole career. Well, he must have been upset. Okay, through the floor grate. Oscorp lost a lawsuit about improper clinical trials years ago. Did they cover this up? I've never heard of it. Now, how 
How do I get out of here? Hello, Peter. Mr. Lee. <gasps> oh, I thought shit. You were in town. Did you find what you were looking for? Martin, you're back. You get that. Thank you. And heading off again shortly, I'm afraid. Just needed a few things from my office. You must have heard about City Hall. Yes. Tragic. Peter was there. He was very lucky. And an Osborne rally. I didn't know you were a fan. Well, what matters is, you are both safe. Amen. But the bombers are still out there. Who knows what they've planned next? Oh, I don't think you or May have anything to worry about. As long as you stay away from places you're not supposed to be. Well, I should go. When will you be back? Damn. Oh. When my work is done. Damn. Okay. Oh, it's fucking fire. <gasps> wait, wait, wait! I finally got your evidence. Head to the Feast Center in Chinatown. What am I going to find? A nice lady named Mae Parker. And some really weird stuff hidden in Lee's office. But listen, he's got another attack planned. Where? When? Still working on that, but I think he's going to use something called Devil's Breath. Sounds destructive. What is it? A substance created by Oscorp. Probably a bioweapon of some kind. I have a folder full of info on it. I'm holding on to it for now. I'll send copies as soon as I can. Okay, we'll check his office. If the evidence stands up, I'll put out an APD. MJ, hey, just checking in. Peter, hey, can I call you back? I think you'll want to hear this. Wait, why are you whispering? Just in the middle of something. How about we catch up over dinner? My place? Oh, sure. I'll even cook. Cool, see ya. Wait. Remember how you told me about Lee's corrupting touch? I think I just saw it in action. How? Some perfectly nice homeless people just jumped me. Thing is, they had glowing eyes. And I remembered Yuri telling me something similar about the guard who released Shocker. So Shocker was working for Lee? Uh, it's all connected. There's more. But I guess we'll talk about it at dinner. Yeah, see ya. Dinner? <sighs> what should I cook? We're watching you, Spider-Man. Oh, these people. I was like, who the fuck is this? Oh, there hi, he doctor. is. How are you? Parker! Exciting news. Come by the lab. Uh, like now? This is my defining moment. Can't wait to show you. Cool. Um, I've got dinner plans. Can I come by later? Dinner can wait. You need to see this, Peter. Uh, okay. Be right there. Wonder if this means I have a job again. Guess I can stop by just for a minute. Here's another call from Doc. Peter, I wanted to make sure you're still available. I can't pay you yet. But I've pulled enough strings to keep the wolves from the door a bit longer. If we can get up and running, I know this new version of the project will attract investment. Massive investment. Stay ready. 
Fingers triple cross, Doc. Think about the block of C4 this is wired to. Damn. Dead man's switch. The other bombs are armed. Need to disable them before they explode. Holy shit, this is so much. Great work, Spider-Man. Happy to help, officer. Stay safe. <laughs> this is kind of cool. Holy shit. Is that what the green thing means? Pinches. Wait, I gotta see. Huh? No, there it goes. Oh. Come on, bitch. Oin. There we go. Taking you home, buddy. Spider-Man. Oh, filling up. Rosa just flew home to join her brothers and sisters. Happy to help. You know these little guys pretty well, huh? Getting there. Sandra always knew him best, of course. Sandra? Oh, uh, my, my wife. Well, tell Sandra she's got some fine birds. Oh, uh, yeah. Sure we are, Spider-Man. Thanks again. And please, keep an eye out. This is safe control. The boss wants a sit rep on the garrison in Chelsea. Traffic control point Charlie taking fire from demons. Gotta stop this before it turns into a massacre. If this is over a parking space, it would be so New York! you do tough stuff demons and sable not sure which is worse Doctor. Hello, Peter. I'll be just a minute. Wow. Look at all this new stuff. What the fuck? What's all this? What the fuck is that? Uh oh, is Otto working with them now? Oh no. Where did 
did you get all this equipment? Called in every last favor. Took out a few loans. It's like we're starting over once again. But this time's going to be different. Our first volunteer subject, Lance Corporal Texador. Lost his arm overseas and now just wants to hug his daughter again. You've been busy. Just getting started. You know, until now, we've been looking at prosthetics from the wrong perspective. Why restore people to what they were when we can make them better? Okay, I think that should do it. Oh, I forgot uh, when we started that shit electrified, uh, electrocuting him. That false test, I guess. Probably why he's acting a little, you know. <laughs> Everything okay? This is all your fault, Norman, you son of a- Well, I know who you're not voting for in the next election. Sorry. I, uh, have a habit of making bad jokes in tense situations. <laughs> uh, it was a good joke, Parker. Just a bit of an overreaction on my part. No, don't worry. Uh, why don't you take a break? I'll, uh, I'll clean this up and uh, get us ready for another test. So, uh, hope you don't mind me asking, but it seems you and Norman have a bit of a history. We were lab partners in college. Became friends. Decided to start a business. We both had visions of changing the world just in different ways. Wait, you were at Oscorp when it started? I'm half the reason it's called Oscorp. In grad school, everyone called us the O's. <sighs> Add Corp to that and, well, it is a catchy name. Well, why'd you leave? Norman became more and more obsessed with genetics. He started a project I considered unethical. And there was this Anyway, lawyers got involved. I chose to leave in exchange for a settlement. But that money didn't last very long. I've relied on grants ever since. If this project doesn't work... Don't worry. It'll work. Uh, let, me, let me just fix this up. I'll brew some fresh coffee. Here we go. Be sure to run a diagnostic on the control unit. More experiment us. There we go. Jesus. All right, what else do we have? Oh, why don't you do the honors this time? We did it. Next step, neural interface. That's a lot of work for you to do by yourself. Sure you can handle it? Apparently not, judging by today's debacle. Because I still haven't found another job. My funds are still... I know. It's okay. Don't worry, I'll figure it out. What's a few bucks when you're trying to change the world, right? To changing the world. from MJ. Doctor, I need to go, but I'll be back later. Don't worry, the work will still be here when you get back. Advanced idea mechanics. Doc, are you sure it's a good idea to accept grants from AIM? Their rep is pretty shady. Beggars can't be choosers, Peter. Once we're on our feet, we'll reevaluate our funding partners. 
Doc really does want to imagine a better version of man. Neural interface would be a big step, Doc. Big, yes, but essential. If our prosthesis is anything less than effortless to use, we'll have failed. We'll get there, Peter. We have to.